It'd be interesting to know or to, to see where the fighters think they are in the contest. Do they think they're ahead? Do they think they're behind? Will this affect the way that they approach this last round? You know, is Jamie, is, if Jamie feels like he's behind, is he going to bite the bullet and go for it here? Right, here we go then. Well, they've got, it, they've got each other's respect now. Yeah, and the, and the pace and the tempo has definitely risen in this last round. They can see the finish line. And they want to leave everything in the, in the ring after this round. The front kick there by Tate. It. Left leg to the head and it's game over. Yeah. And he went down very heavy there. He went there, down very hard on his head. Very hard on his head. Not the way we wanted to see the end of it. If it it's the way he went down, wasn't it? With his head his head hitting the canvas hard and and that knockout came out of nowhere left round kick to the head Andrew had fired in a couple of right hands to the body and, and invested in the left leg on I'm sick every line the crowd's like hey. I didn't get rolled off stack like hey. listen learn every beat hey. Speaking to Andrew before, he was confident of a knockout. And you have to say fair play to him, that's yeah, what he got, got in got the end. And what a way to seal a show. I mean, we thought that we were heading to a decision win. And we've just seen what has to be described as a brutal knockout, head kick knockout. Yeah. And that is what kickboxing is all about. Right, well, I've enjoyed the night. And Neil, thank you so much for coming and um, telling us how it should be done. Th thanks once brilliant. again for having me. Absolutely brilliant, Neil. Thank you. Cheers, bud. Really appreciate it. So that's it from Callum Hall tonight and another champion night for Newark and a champion night for kickboxing. So uh, until next time, it's uh, Mick and Neil and Dennis and Howard. We'll see you all again soon.